Welcome back. 512. Of course, this is Texas, and many of us love eating red meat. But scientists are saying maybe we should be opting for a food option lower in iron levels. A new study is showing the correlation of iron levels in our blood and our lifespan. Sarah Costa explains the findings. If you love cutting into that juicy steak or taking a bite of that burger, you may want to pump the brakes on your red meat intake, according to a recent study. A new study looked at more than 1 million people to study their iron in their blood levels, and findings are suggesting that the iron levels in the blood could play a role in how long you live. The international study using genetic data from more than 1 million people suggests that maintaining healthy levels of iron in the blood could be key to aging better and living longer. Results show too much iron in your blood appear to be linked to an increase in dying earlier. Paul Timmers with the University of Edinburgh in the United Kingdom says that they are excited by these findings as they suggest that high levels of iron in the blood reduces our healthy years of life and keeping these levels in check could prevent age-related damage. He says that the findings on iron metabolism might also start to explain why very high levels of iron-rich red meat in the diet has been linked to age-related conditions such as heart disease. We can add this latest study to the growing evidence that iron overload or our bodies not being able to break it down properly can have an influence on how long we're likely to live as well as how healthy we're likely to be in our later years. Scientists also hope that with this study further down the line we can see the development of drugs designed to lower levels of iron in the blood which could potentially add extra years to our lives. Back to you guys.